What's up guys? So I get a lot of questions about who is the best characters in Final Fantasy Brave Exvius. Well, the problem with that is that it's always changing as new people get five stars and six stars. It is always changing. So we have here the current best in Japan and then in text form, we have the current best slash noteworthy slash useful units here in global uh, currently. So if you are re-rolling in the beginning of the game here global, uh, the best units is arguably Van, uh, Exadeth, Bartz, Cecil, and COD. So those those four or five are the best units that we can get currently. There's also a couple others that are noteworthy. Furion, Garland, Terra, Rosilia. So those are you know noteworthy. They're pretty good units, just not absolutely the best. And then still some useful ones you can see down there. There's about five or six that are useful. And then even further down the list, there is some that are just good trust mastery. So we touched upon trust before, but those that don't know, once you get to 100% trust, you can unequip their trust skill and give it to someone else. That is a huge deal. It will take you a ton and ton of grinding to do that, especially with these rare summon units. But in three to six months, if you work on that unit, you will have the trust mastery skill available. And some of the skills are just godly, like two times attack, uh, you know, double casting, things like that. That is insane. So those guys right there are good for their trust skills, their trust mastery as well. But if you take a look down here in the, the best in Japan chart, we have best in Japan. And you'll notice that almost none of the units that we currently have that are up in our rankings for a global are actually here. There's only a few that are actually here. So we have Exadeth. We have Cecil is still the best tank. You can get Cloud of Darkness, but he's he's ranked three here in Japan. And that's about it, man. I mean, Van is way down here. Van gets, you know, outclassed. So you notice that it doesn't necessarily really matter uh, if you are, you know, rolling a ton right now, rolling for the perfect unit, uh, because as progression happens, you're going to see a lot better units come out. And quite frankly, there isn't that much content right now that is hard at all and challenging. There's only one real trial, the White Dragon boss, that requires, you know, a little bit of challenging or team configuration. Um, but yeah... So don't really stress about getting the best units right now because as you can see, there's a lot of new units that are going to outclass all these old units that we actually have. And even uh, even our basic starter use at Rain is up here as the second best support unit in the game currently in Japan. So pretty craziness right there. If you guys got any questions or comments, post them down below. Thanks for watching.